What's up guys, it's your boy Ace coming at you again with another Madden tip. Today I want to talk about Cover 3 match. It's a new Cover 3 this year. Uh, one that I personally see all the time. I think because a lot of people just don't know how it works. So they don't really know how to beat it efficiently. Um, it actually took me a while to figure it out because I, I wasn't familiar with Cover 3 match before this game. Uh, because I'm more about Madden X's and O's than real life X's and O's. So I wasn't familiar with it. But with that being said, I'm just going to hop right in. And I want to break down what Cover 3 Match does. So, I'm just going to run it. I want you guys just to pay attention to what's going on. Alright, so let's go to Instant Replay. Now let's look at the left side of the field. This is your ISO side. And what that means on Cover 3 Match, that cornerback is going to man up on the fly. And takes him away completely. So that's something you want to exploit. So if if you just don't know that, if you don't know Cover 3 Match does that, well, now you know. But also, it's very hard to beat Cover 3 Match because you don't know the weakness. You don't know who's going to be getting manned up on the fly and all that. So you got to know that to exploit it. So if they're running Cover 3 Match all game, it's going to be very easy to beat them. So as you see... X is about to get unraveled, but you get sacked. Everything else is covered. So, cover three match is a very pesky defense. One that personally gave me problems online until I really went into the lab, figured out how to beat it properly. So, let's exploit the fact that there's a gaping hole on that side of the, the left side of the field. So, what we're going to do, go back to the ISO. Let's pick Cincinnati Y fade, I guess. I guess that's what it called. I don't know if it's Cincinnati, but it was the play at the top. And go to cover three match. Put be on a slant. <clears throat> so if if it's cover three match, which right now we know it is, B is taken away. So I'd probably put a worse player there and put Gronk somewhere else just for the hell of it. If I was using the Pats, of course. And really what we're going to do is put Y on a drag, and that's going to be cover three match. So what I like to do is this. If it's cover three match, they're going to be rushing four. I like to personally look at the, at the defensive line. I want to see if they're coming at me as soon as possible. I need about three seconds to beat them deep. If they get to me quicker than three seconds, I can hit the drag and I can still get a gain. So what I do is I look at the D-line, I kind of count in my head to three, and I instantly look up and try to locate X. X is going to be your big money. See, I didn't get it. You got to be careful because this white cover three match is good. If you get the time, it's very deadly. Got the time. There you go. Take it to the house. You're exploiting that hole on the side. Try it again. Got it again. So now one thing you do need to account for is the fact that most opponents you're going to be facing are going to be using one of those linebackers. So you got to be careful. If you're looking at the D line and you get your eyes up, you really need to locate the user and then make the throw. So it, it adds a little bit more of a hesitation to your decision making, but you got to do what you can do. So... Got it to X. Look at the D line, see if they're coming at me. Hit Y anyways, just because I feel like it. And usually what will happen is that post will go up and block the safety and you can take it you can take it deeper. Let me see if I can do that for you guys. So that's what I'm talking about. Very, very easy way to beat cover three match. I personally see it all the time. I see it way more than I see man coverage. So this is a very valuable tip. If you got a faster guy than Amendola, that'll be very beneficial. But that's basically the gist of it, guys. I mean, I'll show you, like, 
Cover three match is actually a really good defense. Just look, it probably will shut this down completely. Yeah, I mean there was there was nothing open. I'll I'll run another play. See what happens here. All I had open, I should have been sacked by now. I don't even count that. I'll, I'll run that play again. Looks like I can hit Y for a second, but other than that, takes it away. Let's see if I can do. Let's see if it shuts down four verticals. It does because the linebacker matches up on the fly. So it's a very good defense. You just gotta know, you know. If he's running it all the time, you just got to know the weakness. Run it one last time just so you guys get a good taste of it. And take it to the house, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tip. Uh, please drop a like. really helps me out. And let's aim for 25 today, which will be a new high. Um, and, of course, if you like daily Madden tips, please hit the sub button.